Today, I'm going to be sharing with you a new AI tool which I use to convert text to video. And of course, I will share with you the AI tools I use, how I use the various AI tools and the prompt I use for this specific tool. Beginning with the first step, I will first of all want to take you to the dashboard of the AI tool itself. It looks like this from the front end. And you can see that inside here, I can come to this area that says text to video and click on it directly. Once I click on that, I'm going to see this particular dashboard area. And within this area, that's select text to video. I can give it a prompt. And once I give a prompt, I can come to create based on the prompt I've given. What I like to do most is to make sure that I go to a platform called ChatGPT and create an account so as to assist me to create some specific prompt. You want to make sure that you go to chatgpt.com and also create an account and logged in. Inside of ChatGPT, once you have an idea of anything you want to create as text to video based on prompt, you want to ask ChatGPT to help you with the idea of prompt. As an example, I have this prompt here, a giant cat running through the water in the night landscape in anime style. Of course, once you have an idea like this, for you to get good and specific prompt, you want to give it to ChatGPT and click on the submit button and ChatGPT will help you to generate some prompt for you. And of course, you can even ask it to give you even one or more or maybe three to four different prompts so that you are going to test the various prompts and select the best one. As an example, you can say, give me at least four prompts. You can ask ChatGPT to give you at least four different AI prompts based on the idea you have so that you are going to test each and every one of them and the one which is best suitable, you are going to use it. I will submit now for ChatGPT to construct four different AI prompts for me based on the idea which I have. I'll go ahead to be copying each and every one of these prompts and give it inside of the text to video and see which one we have the best. Now you can see ChatGPT has already given me the four different prompts. I want to start with the first one here. You can see based on the idea I have, I'll copy the prompt and come here inside of this prompt box and insert it here as a plain text as you can see here. Now, of course, I want to come to this area. You can see inspiring prompt to draw clips. You can as well switch this on if you like. Then I will come here and choose the aspect ratio of the video I want. To those of you who want to go for shots or to create YouTube shots based on the prompt, which is very nice, of course, you can choose 9 by 16, as you can see it here. But for a landscape video or for the normal YouTube video size, you want to use 16 by 9 landscape. Now, of course, here I want to come to this area that says create and hit on the create button. Now you're going to see that this particular tool, you can see my video will start to generate. And now based on the text, the video will be given to me based on the prompt being given. You are going to see this notification here. Your video is generating and also your video is generating and the system is operating at full capacity. You want to give it a little weight for it to be generated and serve to you. And now you can see that it has been generated here. There are two different styles which has been presented to me. You want to make sure to go ahead to choose what style suits your need. You can also come to this area that says my video and click on it. And you are going to see the history of what you have created. And you can see the preview like this as an example you can see this is it here the video you have created you can see it here you can still make sure that you go ahead to copy another prompt once i copy the next prompt i want to come here to replace this area as a plain text and see what we have next and i want to also create here and see the next creation you can see the next video i've created here you can see based on the various prompts, this were the first prompt which I give it to ChatGPT. It didn't suit my need because they are just standing images. But this one is very realistic. You can see this video here is very realistic as you can see here. You can see the next video I've created. It looks very realistic. And based on the prompt I've used, 
This is the kind of video I want, looking very realistic. The motion and images looks very real. The eye blinking, you can see, is very real. As compared to these other ones here, this is just a standing image, which is just flipping, which I don't like. This one also, I don't like it. And based on this prompt, I think this prompt is good. The next prompt, which ChatGPT has given me. I want to click on it to expand so that you see how it looks like. This is it here. The video looks very realistic and real. Of course, I can use this for my project. This is great. And of course, you want to make sure that you go ahead to try all of the various prompts being given to you by ChatGPT. And at the end result, you want to make sure that you choose the best result being displayed to you. Of course, I want you also to comment below this video to tell us which of these which you like are the best, the first generation or the second generation. Just tell us in the comment section. And of course, before I go, I'll let you know the name of the tool. It is called PixVerse. As you can see here, PixVerse. And I will share with you the URL itself. And the name of the AI tool I use for this generation is called PixVerse.ai. If you use this URL and open on your browser, you're going to see a front page that looks like this. Create breathtaking video with AI. And of course, you can see a front page that looks like this. These are samples generation from the front end, looking realistic as you can see here. And with this same AI tool, you can use it to convert text to video, just as you have seen what I've done from within this insight by using some specific prompt idea which I have. Then I expand the idea using ChatGPT by asking ChatGPT to give me four different prompt idea based on the idea I have. Then I use each and every one of the prompts and come back inside of the tool and ask it to generate the various prompts for me. I go ahead to make sure that based on the various prompts, I select the best one, which I think is the best for me and use it for my project. And once that has been done, if you like it, then you want to make use of this area, this download area, which you can see here and click on download and it is going to be downloaded to your system. If you come back to the video section, you're going to see this is the video here. If you want to use it, click on it and download the video by coming to this download button that you can see here and click on download. And once you click on download, it will be downloaded to your system, which can be used for your project. You can see I've clicked on the download and this is the download here. It has been downloaded to my system. Now I want to click on it to open it. It is now already on my system. And this is the video here now inside of my computer device. You can see this is it here and it is going to play on my screen. You can see this is the video. I've downloaded the video and this is the AI tool which I use to create text to video to be used for my specific project. It is a new AI tool and you can use it to start to see how you can create text to video. Do not forget to like, comment and subscribe for new upcoming tutorials and see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.